What is up, you guys? It's Dominic. Dominic Plus. Back with you guys here today to do my WWE Elimination Chambers, uh, Chambers Elimination Chamber uh, results and reactions. So, uh, on my predictions video, I said that I thought Luke Gallows and Carl Anderson would face the revival, uh, but they ended up facing Scott Do or not Scott Dawson, uh, Bo Dallas and um, Curtis Axel, which was weird. So Luke Gallows and Carl Anderson won that match. So I'm just gonna scrap that off. Um, I don't know why they didn't do the Revival versus Gals and Anderson. I guess they want to save it for Mania pre-show, maybe. I don't know. Uh, not that it couldn't be. Uh, that would be a good match I would like to see on the uh, main uh, on the pre-show, you know. I think lots of people like that. Uh, but, yeah, uh, so that was the pre-show. And right now we have the uh, Raw Women's Championship Elimination Chamber match. So, Sonya Deville and Bayley. Uh, are starting out, and I'll give you the results when the match is over. Alright, so we had uh, Alexa Bliss retain her title in the uh, first ever uh, Women's Elimination Chamber for the uh, Raw Women's Championship, so that was a pretty good match. Uh, Sasha Banks turned heel on um, Bailey. They were climbing the cage because Alexa Bliss was trying to get away from uh, Banks and Bailey, and um, uh, Sasha. Or when Bailey was climbing, Sasha kicked Bailey off the, like she was climbing, and Sasha kicked her off the pod. Uh, and so yeah, I think she turned heel. So yeah, but my prediction was right. Alexa Bliss uh, did w end up winning. Um, so yeah, um, pretty good match for the first ever Raw Women, uh, Women's Elimination Chamber. Cham chamber, sorry. Um, and there was a cool little promo at the end where Alexa was like fake crying i guess and she was like oh this is for all the little girls uh i know that you guys will not <laughs> accomplish your dreams so this is for you basically is what she said but right now we have uh sheamus and cesaro defending their raw tag team titles against titus worldwide uh so that that should be uh okay probably not it's probably not gonna be that good it'll probably be an average match but yeah i'll give you the results for it up next Alright, so we just had the bars Seamus and Cesaro defeat uh, Apollo Crews and uh, Tyus mm -hmm. O'Neal to retain their Raw Tag Team titles. And um, it was an okay match, I guess. Um, yeah, so Cesaro and Seamus retained their title. And yeah, I'll, I don't know what match is going to be next, but I'll give you the results for that up next. Alright, so we just had... Um, uh, Asuka versus uh, Nia Jax, and Asuka ended up defeating Nia Jax, and um, she barely did. She got a roll-up, actually, on Nia Jax, which I thought they were going to push Asuka, you know, harder than that, and actually ever, like, you know, submit or something, but I guess not. But yeah, Asuka defeated uh, Nia Jax, and then um, towards the end, uh, Naya attacked, uh, Asuka, and, um, put her through the barricade, like, speared her through the barricade, so, I don't know, it was an okay match, I really liked the ending, um, and, yeah, um, pretty good ending, um, uh, but, I don't know how that makes Asuka look strong before Mania, but, I mean, we got some time. But anyways, up next we'll see Matt Hardy versus Bray Wyatt. So yeah, I'll give you the results for that up next. Alright, so we had, um, let me get in a better light. So we had, um, uh, Matt Hardy defeat Bray Wyatt in an average match. But I did like how, um, they had, like, Matt Hardy, well, Bray Wyatt, like, tried to outsmart Matt Hardy and appear in the ring before the match started. Oh, well, like... For the bell ring, he went, he did the thing, and he just appears in the ring. But Matt Hardy left his coat in the ring, and he was nowhere to be found. But um, when Bray goes looking out of nowhere, he hits a, uh, what is it, flying forearm or whatever. And yeah, I thought that was pretty smart. And after that, it was an average match. But yeah, it was a pretty cool um, well, I'm not gonna lie, it wasn't that good, but, um, it was okay, I guess, um, so, yeah, 
Up next, we'll probably have the Ronda Rousey contract signing, so I'll kind of go in depth with that if that's what's next. I'm pretty sure it is next, so I'll go into depth uh, with whatever's next. Uh, uh, well, it's going to be a second for you, but it's going to be like 30 minutes for me, so uh, yeah. Well, so I'll see you in a second. Alright, so we just had um, Ron Rousey's contract signing, and it was pretty good. I didn't think it was going to be good, but I enjoyed it. Um, so what had happened was Ronda was coming out, and, you know, um, Triple H and, um, oh, sorry, Elimination Chamber is about to start. But, um, yeah. So, um, Triple H and Stephanie say something like, congratulations, blah, 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 and Rhonda's like, Rhonda looks over, she's like, Kurt, do you want to say anything? And Kurt's like, yeah, just congratulations, you know, you, you deserve it, blah, 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 um, so yeah, and then Kurt's like, they just want to get revenge for you, uh, from WrestleMania 31, when, uh, of course, Rhonda flipped over at uh, Triple H and uh, almost broke Stephanie's arm. So, I mean, Triple H is like, shut up. And Stephanie's like, oh, he just has the flu. So they take um, Kurt back and he's like, and he's like, um, what did he say? I for Oh, well, Ice is playing in the middle of the chamber. Uh, I Oh, yeah, and then Kurt's, like, when he's walking up the ramp, he's like, oh, when Stephanie in her office called you a has-been, and Rhonda's, like, super mad, and then Triple H comes in, and they're about to fight, and then she, he gets out, Stephanie, and then uh, Rhonda picks up <laughs> Triple H and just throws him through the table like it was nothing, <clears throat> and then Stephanie goes out from behind, and turns Ronda around, slaps her in the face, so, yeah, um, sorry for that long explanation, and then Ronda signs and throws a contract on Triple H, so it does look like they're building towards, uh, Ronda Rousey and Kurt Angle versus Stephanie McMahon and, um, Triple H, so, that might be interesting, uh, for WrestleMania, uh, Triple H said she will be in a match, though, so, not for the title, uh, for a title, though, so, yeah, uh, I'll give you the results for your Elimination Chamber up next. Alright, so, um, yeah, I forgot to film the Elimination Chamber, uh, results, um, I'm, and I'm at my work right now, actually, um, so I thought I'd just give them to you so I can upload it before Monday Night Raw starts. So we had uh, Roman Reigns defeat um, everybody in the Elimination Chamber. Um, so yeah, he will be going to WrestleMania. And um, yeah, it was a pretty good match. Uh, uh, I like the spot where Braun and the Miz are on the top and Braun of the Chamber. And Braun just throws him off onto the, um, off of the Chamber onto like all, everybody. That was a good spot. Um... Yeah, and there was just some really good spots in that match. Really enjoyed the match. Uh, all in all, Elimination Chamber was pretty good. So, yeah. Um, so, I suggest you definitely check out the Elimination Chamber uh, men's match. It was pretty good. So, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. Like, share, and subscribe. Follow me on Wrestling Me you know, at the Dominus Toy Show. As always, thank you guys for watching. D-Low.